Is it recording? Yes, it is recording. Hi, I'm JC Krupa. <laughs> JC Krupa. This is a mic in my hand. So, like, I thought for the song I'm dropping on Friday, I'll give you guys, like, a little bit of behind the scenes type Ooh. stuff. There's, it's, there's not a lot. This is We're in, like, my ghetto studio right now, so if you don't know, I'm working for this camp this summer called Texas Alliance Camp. I'm a camp counselor for special needs kids, um, but I still wanted to put at least one song out this summer for you guys, so I kind of turned um, one of the rooms that nobody uses in the counselor's lounge into my own studio. So let's take a tour. You have this corner with this... Uh, that corner is so fancy. ...that I have lyrics written on. That was actually his freestyle. Yeah, that was yeah. fake love freestyle lyrics. Fake love freestyle lyrics over there. Yeah. My phone is on the charger here. Always gotta um, have that. Always gotta have a phone on the charger because I have a Galaxy. Businessman. Backpack on the chair. Um. So, so this is funny. So this is the mic I've been using. This is actually a camera mic. I was originally using this one, but like it was giving me problems and stuff. And this one's like a much higher grade of mic, so this is actually the mic that I use to record the actual song dropping on Friday. And this is one you'll probably see in future YouTube videos and stuff. They're still both great mics, but that one's superior. So, yeah, this is a stand <laughs> that was no actually for way. the. No uh, way. It was actually for the freaking uh, the, the the poster board that I wrote the lyrics on, but I kind of just took it. This poster board. Yeah. Was on this stand, y'all. I put the the mic on it. See, it's not even like attached professionally. This is such a ghetto studio. Do you want to show them like the hole in the ceiling <laughs> above where I've been recording? He picked the most raunchiest place. Yeah. In this whole room best, to record. Best artist starting the ghetto. And then people came in here. And now there's like toothpicks and cups near all the wires. He blames the people, and I'm pretty sure it was him. He doesn't I, let anybody else come in it here. It wasn't me. There were some people yeah. in here yesterday. It's my laptop. It's kind of crappy, but it gets the job done. Here's another it's like its corner. owner. It's lit. It's another corner. I don't know how my reading glasses got in this corner, but you know, here's some water that I got for for um, Miranda. You're lying. Place. I already poured that out and it fell on the floor. That is not mine. Really? Really. Whose water is this? I don't know. You see those other cups right there? That's also in here. I'm so confused. Right? There's a ghost trying to like stop this. It's song the coup spirit, remember? But funny thing about this song. I've actually had this song recorded and done since like April, but I wasn't happy with it and I thought I could do a lot better so I actually rewrote it this summer and so like I think the bars hit a lot harder now and everybody who's heard the old version the new version kind of agree. So yeah, but um, what other kind of like behind the scenes stuff is there? Nothing. I recorded this song so What was the meaning behind your song? Oh, so Preach, it's about, it's basically like a song just me getting like some stuff off my chest um taking a couple shots at a couple people but so it's kind of like it's not really i don't want to say too much but i mean it's just a song where i'm kind of like sharing my views on some things and it's like me preaching like the truth even though some people might not like it and it's not appealing like if you're wearing an ugly shirt like, you can not like it all you want, but, like, the truth is you're wearing an ugly shirt. That's probably a bad analogy, but that was off the dome. And he says he has bars, y'all. I got bars on bars on bars. Mm. Just, I'm an awful freestyler. <laughs> um, Never asked me to free. I, that's I, why he wrote it down. I know. I freestyle for the kids at camp. Don't show them the lyrics. <laughs> I freestyle for the kids at camp, but just because, like, the bars are dumb and they laugh. And they're like, you're the best thing ever. And I'm like... This is not a good freestyle, but I don't know. I've been loving this song. He's low-key boasting. I'm not so. boasting. I'm, she thinks I'm, like, hella cocky when I'm, like, you are hella a lot cocky. less cocky than I used to be. But, um, yeah, so this is this is me. This is my studio. This For is now. Preach. Dropping Friday. Gang, gang, gang. Um, what else? Follow me on Instagram, at Grand Canyon Lion. You, you know, yeah, I don't want to really edit this video much, so, like... We're probably just going to upload it like this. But yeah, um, I also want to do a um, Q&A uh, questionnaire like video soon. I told you guys once I hit 100 subscribers that I would do that. have not forgotten about that. I've just been hella busy uh, working this summer and doing things like this. So um, also Weekly Words will be returning this fall with Weekly Grinds. 
I, I still love Jesus. I'm a preacher first and foremost, but I'm also pursuing my passion of music now too. So yeah. Anything to add, Miranda? No, JC Grupa. No? Okay. No. Well, this is me signing out. I already told them where to follow me and stuff like that. All right.